Hello to everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all are doing well. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Achola and here on Achola's Closet, we talk fashion, personal style, and how to look and feel amazing at any budget. For today's video, it's honestly such a beautiful day today, but for the last couple of days, it's been snowing and I finally had the chance to bring all of my boots out so I thought we'll talk boots today and I'm so excited to share with you guys my collection but before we dive into the video for the outfit of the day you already know it's almost the end of day here and I barely got to wear you know a lot of the things in my closet so making videos now is another excuse to wear all of my fancy things so for today I am wearing my Y Project long dress. You guys seen her in the Y Project video. Love the print. So comfortable. It just, you know, it hugs and just sits so well on. As for the earrings, I am wearing my massive hoops. And that is from Simons. I bought this, I think, last year. So they might come back soon for Christmas because it was a part of the Christmas, you know, accessories and whatnot so fingers crossed they come back soon because I'm looking for the silver one as well now here's the thing I bought the silver one one day on my way to work it just fell off my ear and I lost a pair I'm looking forward for them to come back again in stock so I can actually buy you know a full set again for me personally the bigger the hoops the better I cannot stand this tiny little hoops now don't get me wrong they look amazing on some people but for me I just I just I don't like them I don't know what it is but yes tiny hoops are not my thing and that is decided now back to the video we're going to start with the booties and then we'll make our way up to my you know hip high boots so the first one for booties is going to be this one right here the brand is seven dials now i found this at winners here's the story I love wearing my high heels to work even though I can't wear heels at work. So I wear it to work and I just carry my flats with me, put it in my purse and whatnot. One morning I forgot my flats at home and um, you know, and Winners usually opens a little bit early. So I was like, you know what, let's just pop into Winners, see what we can find. The goal was to find something really cheap because I'm only going to wear it for one day. And yes, these boots has only been worn once and never gravitate towards it ever since. Um, so I think I'm just gonna, you know, get rid of it. It's made out of uh, yarn braided into this with some leather details. It has a zipper right here. Honestly, it's very light, very comfortable, but it's just, not me so next up is going to be my Chelsea boots right here now this one is from Simon's I think I bought it last year and as you can see I've been wearing the life out of it I absolutely love this it's super comfortable my only issue with this one is the heel now the heels are so loud you can literally hear me a mile away which I hate but other than that I love these boots and I wear it a lot one of these boots that I feel like everybody needs to have in their closet is definitely a rain boot now this one is a short version I got this one from college spring about three years ago so I wear it a lot more in spring and fall sometimes in fall, I'll layer it with, you know, with some nice wool socks to just, you know, keep my feet warm. But other than that, they are just basic, you know, rain boots with some great grip at the bottom here. But I absolutely love this. Now, if you can, you know, invest in a tall version, even better, like the Hunter boots, those are beautiful so now last but not least for my Chelsea boots my CK 205 Claire 
Chelsea Boots. You've seen her in few videos now, but I absolutely love these boots. They are so comfortable. I think this was from uh, Ralph Simmons' last collection for Calvin Klein. Originally, I bought this in a 36, no, a six and a half. And um, with that one, I found it just a little bit tight, you know, like around here. It was just so tight that I couldn't wear all day. However, one of my clients ended up buying the 38 right which is seven and a half and she was like you know what the seven and a half is a little bit too big for me so we ended up swapping the shoes and i'm so glad i was actually able to do that because now with the 38 it's just so comfortable i can wear all day long and you know my feet are just in heaven moving along to the high heel booties for one is going to be my black you know chunky heel booty right here this one is from college spring she's about three and a half maybe four years now when I went into the store they didn't have it in my size so I ended up buying a size six which fits a little bit more like a six and a half because it's not too tight but it is tight um, can't wear it with socks but I can wear it with, you know, stockings and whatnot. And I just love styling this with everything from pants to dresses to skirts, especially with, you know, stockings and then a short skirt. It's just gorgeous. And I love that it's more of a block heel, kind of just makes it a little bit more comfortable. Now, last but not least for the booties is going to be my sock booties right here. Again, from College Spring. And over the years, I've worn the life out of the shoes. As you can see, she's got salt marks all over her. I do have to clean this one before I wear it out for sure. Now, whether you have a skinny ankle, a thicker ankle, sock boots are just the best booties out here. I love them and it just, you know, it fits so well. It just hugs your legs as well. And, um, you know, for the longest time, I wanted to get those sock boots in like, let's say a knee length or like thigh highs, but I just, I never really found one that I really liked. And uh, when it came to the color, I bought this in burgundy because I have a burgundy pleather pants and I like to pair them together to kind of just gives you an illusion of, you know, like, um, pant boots or you know like a, yes a pant boot type of look is what I was going for and these ones are absolutely comfortable even the heel themselves it's about four maybe four and a half inch high but I can wear this literally for almost an entire day at work that's how comfortable they are now when it comes to tall boots you already know I prefer thigh highs or hip highs over you know knee length boots um just something about them i don't know i find them a lot more me and um because you know over the years i'm one of these girls i still wear skirts during winter and whatnot so the taller the boots i feel like the better they are now the first one i'm going to share with you is my flats you know thigh high boots here this one is also from college spring as you can tell i buy a lot of shoes from college spring i don't know i just you know price wise they're inexpensive quality wise they have great quality as well i have shoes from college spring that are about 10 years and i can still wear those shoes out everything honestly just depends on how you take care of them if you take good care of your things they will last you longer now these boots i absolutely love them i bought them i think maybe two years ago now it's been about two years now next up is definitely the white one and you guys have been seeing her for a while now this one is from mdx now if you don't know about mdx as well i made a video 
on everything I ever bought from MDX. Yes, I absolutely love these boots and of course everybody needs to have a gorgeous white boots in their closet. And sticking with MDX and boots, next up is going to be my platform red thigh high boots right here. I absolutely love these boots. I bought it about four years ago from MDX and I have been wearing the life out of these boots. I cannot even tell you. One of the best things about this boot is that the top here is foldable. So when you fold it over, when you fold it like this, the boot becomes knee length and when you do this, it's more of a thigh high style. Love, love, love the platform heel. And as you can see, baby is getting old as she is, you know, getting discolored and all. Um, so I've been thinking recently what to do with it. I still, I can't decide yet, but I'll probably just, you know, add some glitter on her or something like that, make it more shiny. So I might actually end up doing that just to, uh, just so I can continue to wear this thing out as the heel and everything still in great condition. I've gotten the heel fixed once since I bought this four years ago. So, you know, great, great, great pair of shoes. And I love the red, you already know, red is one of my favorite colors. Continuing on with MDX boots. Next up is my black, pair right here she's also above the knee i guess you can call her thigh high love the pointy toe she's about four inch high now one of my favorite favorite things about these boots is definitely the buckles you know it's just so gorgeous i love the gold with the stones it's just so stunning it makes this boot so much sexier now it's got a full zipper on the inside here now the bad news is this one was the last pair in store and she is a six and a half which actually fits great if i find anything similar to it i will link it down below in the description box so this baby is suede it feels very soft now all of MDX boots, I find that the lining is the soft material and it also has a little bit of a cushiony, you know, layer underneath. So when you put it on, it just, you know, it just hugs your feet and it just feels so comfortable and light as well. And that's why I love getting my boots from MDX. Last but not least for my MDX collection, is the silver boots right here i cannot tell you how much i love this boots she is a thigh high right she's got all of the stones it's just so stunning so sparkly now i kid you not i think two years ago sequined or sparkly boots were the thing so that Christmas I got a sparkly high heel and to be honest with you I had something similar like it in my closet so I ended up going back to MDX to see if I can exchange that shoes into something else and as I was looking through and whatnot this one caught my eyes however it was the only pair in store and it's a size 9 I said, what the hell? If it fits or not, I love these boots. I'm taking it. And with it being two size too big, I have to wear it with some thick socks just to make sure this thing fits comfortably and I don't feel like my feet are coming out of it. Because I wear it everywhere from work to parties. I haven't worn out grocery shopping, but 
you never know with me you just never know so when it comes to the details of it it's got a zipper on the side here like a half zipper and on the top you also have the uh, string that you can pull now this one is an elastic string which is kind of nice so it sits a little bit more comfortably but I absolutely love this boots and um, because I don't have enough room in my closet to you know have my boots stand and whatnot I keep them all in their boxes because I feel like that's just the only way to keep them you know in good condition and um, I just I don't want to put them in the closet and have them kind of just sitting however and then you know they start to get damaged and whatnot now let's move along to my hip high boots literally hip high but when it comes to the hip high boots I have a couple maybe will be three soon but I have a couple here that I want to share with you the first one is Python Akira hip high boots right here I cannot tell you how much I love these boots and I can't wait to wear it out now that I can actually wear it out because I bought this I think back in was it May or June I can't even remember but just been sitting in the box since they got here well I did that video showed you guys um, but yes ever since it's just been sitting in the box so now I'm just happy that the weather is finally right for boots so I can finally wear her out but it is you know it's like a velvet material it just feels so soft and I love the print again almond toe four and a half inch high heel as for the size this one it's a size seven however it's a big size seven it fits like a seven and a half almost but I don't mind because I can wear it with thick socks especially for the colder days and when it comes to the inside here we've got a zipper at the bottom you know to help us get in and out of them whereas when it comes to the thigh I know this right here just sits on your inner thigh and then um, it just sits on your inner thigh and this one kind of just covers your outer thigh almost to like your bum literally I'm not even joking but I absolutely love these boots and as I said can't wait to wear it out now speaking of Akira I was on Akira last week and um, I was just looking at boots because I need a new pair of flat boots my latest addition that is on her way is this one right here I can't wait for it to get here so I can wear the life out of it as well I just love the chunky the chunkiness of the heel you know but also the grip because our winters here get a little crazy so I can use all the grip I can get so I'm not you know slipping all over the place and the faux leather looks really nice so I'm hoping that it looks and feels like it looks and feels in the picture um, but yes, yeah, so I'm looking forward to that one and I can't wait to share it with you guys now last but not least for my hip high boots you've already seen her as well and that is the Y project boots I mean with boots like this who needs pants right and that's the thing some days I wake up and I don't feel like wearing pants that's where boots like this comes you know comes in handy because all I can do is just put on my boots put on a shirt and I'm ready to get out and don't have to worry about pants well I absolutely love her I wore it to work last week and um, I learned that this baby is not the most comfortable pair of boots but honestly all of the boots I own are not that comfortable they're only good for up to three hours maybe um, after that it's kind of just like okay let's get out of these and put something else on 
um, but I still love her I think she is gorgeous and I'm still you know I'm glad I bought this and added into my closet but with that that is it um, I hope you guys enjoy the video thank you so much for watching don't forget to give it a like subscribe hit that bell so you get notified every time I drop a video leave me a comment down below share the video you enjoy the rest of the week and I will see you very soon bye